It's become a distant memory after this morning's shock chilly start across many parts of England and Wales. We saw a widespread ground frost, temperatures falling below freezing in one or two spots. We saw minus one there in Bournemouth. Now that was under clear skies and that's been translated into some beautiful autumnal sunshine across much of England and Wales as we can currently see across Cardiff. And that's how it's going to stay across many parts of England and Wales through the rest of today. Although we'll see a little bit more in the way of cloud over northern England, but it's steadily brightening up over northern Ireland and at southern and eastern Scotland. We'll even see some hazy sunshine and temperatures could hit 18 in Aberdeen. But up to the northwest, it's a different story. Lots of cloud here, some spells of rain quite heavy over the hills, and we're going to see some strong winds too. So not particularly warm here at 13 or 14 degrees, but further south in lighter winds than yesterday, that sunshine's feeling a little bit warmer with temperatures around at 16 to 19 degrees. Now we're going to keep fine and clear skies through this evening and tonight over much of England and Wales, but most of the action is still going to be over northern Scotland with all this rain and we'll see more cloud over Scotland and Northern Ireland so it's not going to be particularly cold here. Further south it's another chilly night probably not as cold as last night even so we're still going to see a touch of ground frost in many areas but uh, once again after that frosty start we'll even see a little bit of the early morning mist too it's going to be fine and sunny for the most part across England and Wales. Bright too to start with over Northern Ireland southern and eastern Scotland but that wet and windy weather up towards the northwest edging into more southern parts of western Scotland through the afternoon and into western parts of Northern Ireland. Now very windy here with those gales coming in from the south. So again, not a warm day at 15 or 16, but in the south with the winds coming in from a southerly direction, even warmer than today with highs of around 19 or 21 degrees. But then it's all changed through Thursday night and Friday. That massive area of cloud and rain is going to be sweeping its way southwards. So we'll say goodbye to the milder winds coming in from the south or southwest and and see much cooler, blustery winds on Friday coming in from the northwest. Now that rain will still be across parts of southeastern England late on Friday. Behind it, bright weather, plenty of blustery showers though, and those showers really quite squally in those very strong and gusty north and northwest winds, and it is going to feel chilly out in that wind. Now on Saturday, most of the showers are going to be out in the east. We'll see the winds gradually easing. We'll see a little bit of brightness too coming through in the west. And here's where we like to see the best of the sunshine as we head into Wednesday. But still those showers rattling down the eastern side of the country with temperatures recovering slowly. So it's a rather changeable.